Pitcairn High School and Trafford High School played football for the Victory Bell. Those schools morphed into Gateway and Penn Trafford, but they're still playing for the Bell all these years later, and a lot more than that. Like an early advantage in the 5A Big East Conference, Penn Trafford turned it over on downs on their first possession, and the first time Gateway snapped the ball, Derek Davis showed why he's ranked one of the top 100 juniors in the country. With scholarship offers from over 20 schools already, he goes 66 yards. Jason Jenkins adds the extra point, 7 to nothing Gateway. Penn Trafford answered, though. On third and one, Gabe Dunlop gets a lot more, 26 yards in all, all the way down to the Gateway three-yard line. And he took it in himself two plays later. Nathan Schlesinger added the extra point. Penn Trafford had run 18 plays to Gateway's one. Still, it was only 7-7. The Achilles heel for Gateway, turnovers. They had at least one in every quarter, six overall. Early in the third on the 11th play of what looked like a promising drive, Bonanzio is intercepted by Caleb Lisbon. He had three interceptions in the game. That turned into the go-ahead touchdown. Dunlap to Ethan Carr, a 34-yard hookup, 14-7 Penn Trafford. The game's still up for grabs, though, going into the fourth quarter. But after Lisbon's third interception, he gets a touchdown reception from Dunlap, a 12-yarder. That made it 21-7 Penn Trafford. Then the clincher, Cole D. Filippo with a pick six makes it 28-7. The Gators would then lose Derek Davis with a late injury, and that would be the final. When he takes off on that first play from scrimmage, I'm thinking, oh boy. But it almost looked to me like your defense got mad at itself and kept them in check the rest of the night. Yeah, we did. Uh, our defense, I mean, without question, you can't argue how great our defense played tonight. Bob Weston, our defensive coordinator, is one of the best in the business. Uh, and our kids responded to that, and they tackled hard, and they just played physical as heck, and it was, it was a great defensive effort tonight. The line put a, bit, a big amount of pressure on that QB, and all the film we've been watching, our coaches got us real ready for this game. How big was this game tonight? Well, it was a standing room only crowd. The 50-50 was worth almost $2,000. Two years ago, these two teams played at Heinz Field for the 5A championship. Don't be surprised if they meet again somewhere else down the road. But for tonight, the bell tolls for Penn Trafford.